Lizzo's Purpleberry Punch. You want a punch? We've got your punch right here. This is Halcyon News. We interrupt your regularly scheduled advertisement for the following story. CNP, I can't believe it's not yours. It's unbelievable how good it is. When you were sick, who took your temperature? When you were hungry, who gave you a needle full of love? Auntie Cleo, that's who. Have you given your auntie a hug today? You've been listening to Halcyon News, your mandated duty as a good citizen of Halcyon. If you're hungry, you've come to the right place. I've got a fresh ground batch of Spratwurst cooking. They're terrified to lock in the juices. How about a grinder's dozen? You know what Sprats are? Space rats. The laboratories of Spacer's Choice found a use for this limitless frontier resource. Sprat meat is plenty tasty when properly prepared. We grind them up in sausages, then terror fry them in their own juices. Terror frying is a Spacer's Choice brand secret. A mix of 13 herbs and spices, plus a dash of modern chemistry. Absolutely not. Spratwurst and all related terms are registered trademarks of Spacer's Choice. Boar, the other meat, is a registered trademark of C&P. Everyone knows our company and theirs are nothing alike. Legally? No. The terrifying method was developed and marketed by Spacer's Choice. Between you, me, and this grinder, I've been through lean times. If there's one thing you learn on tramp freighters, it's how to make near anything edible. Might be that this old space hand put a few words in the right ears, and could be that Spacer's Choice liked sticking it to C&P by R&Ding our own special meat. Just as well, near about time for me to go check on the trap. I mean, to unload another crate of farm fresh sprats. Fresh from the grinder, any hour. You're here. It'll do a lot for my credit in the promenade if people see you buying something. So, what'll it be? Everything I sell is fresh from the forge. Technically, the metal formed billions of years ago, but it's freshly in this shape. Not me, but it's in my blood. After the crossing, my family worked Eridanos, indentured to the corporations. I was born in the corporate labor, but I'm the first one of my family to buy my way out. That's why I settled on Groundbreaker. It's the last bastion of freedom.